Hello everyone, how are you all doing? Welcome to another video log. Uh, you might have noticed, or maybe not, that I've changed a little bit to the, the the frequency that I've been doing video logs and I've been trying to focus them on one single subject. I do typically do a lot of things at the same time, uh, but I figured that it might be a bit better for people to focus at one topic at a time. I don't know, let me know what you think on the comments below. Um, so yeah, anyways, uh, today I'm going to focus on uh, the stuff that I've been doing, organizing a new online event for the demo scene. It's going to called, uh, it's going to be called OMZG. It's the return of Mulvania Zine Gathering that I first organized back in 2005. It was sort of like a fake party, fake demo party for the demo scene. We had a party report, we had some uh, releases, but the party never actually took place. And... Um, we saw that there was this slot available in uh, February where the only major demo party that was happening was uh, Mountain Bites and it got cancelled because uh, COVID situation in Switzerland uh, skyrocketed on the last couple of months. So they decided to cancel it. There was no online version of Mountain Bites, so I decided to go ahead and um, organize a party. We have a bunch of different... Um, Compose. None of them are like the traditional uh, stuff that you would see at a normal demo scene event. And the reason for that is, one, because it's a weird party. It's in Mulvania, of all places. So they have their own ideas of who, wow, what kind of uh, demo compost to have. And for those who don't know what the hell Mulvania is, Mulvania is a fake country uh, that was made up by some comedians in Australia. Uh... They wanted to do like a, a tourist guide to uh, a country that was part, uh, used to be part of the USSR. It didn't have any selling point whatsoever. The major selling point was that it was the the starting spot for the co for the whooping cough. It was the birthplace of the whooping cough. That was one of the selling points. And they made up this character called Zlad, who tried to compete uh, at the Eurovision contest, but never actually made it. He was uh, stopped at the airport for uh, carrying drugs. But they, he did release uh, two tracks that became viral on the internet. One of them is Electronic Supersonic, and the other one is called I Am the Antipope. And back in 2005, uh, or 2004, around that part, we were watching those videos a lot and having a lot of fun with that and we came up with the idea of having a demo party in Mulvania because why not um so this year we decided to resurrect well I decided to resurrect uh and uh, I got a few people together on my discord who might be interested in helping me co-organize uh managed to get uh, Aldroid to set up the woohoo instance for for the thing uh, alien's going to help me with the votes genio is going to help me with some uh, music stuff and uh, I'm going to organize a Shader Royale on the 12th of February. Um, and I'm going to organize all the compost will be on the 13th of uh, February. So only these two days, Friday and Saturday. And uh, the compost that we're going to have are going to be very theme specific. One is graphics featuring ramen because we were supposed to have a ramen focused demo party at some point. But uh, I decided a graphics combo would be more than enough. Uh, then we have the Zlad Music Remix combo. Mm, either uh, Supersonic, Electronic Supersonic or I Am The Antipope. Uh, remix it, rework it, make it on like a uh, old school platform. Like I would like to, ha I would like to hear it play on a ZX Spectrum, for example. Uh, things like that. Um, then we have the acapella demo scene cover, uh, where you have to sing uh, a demo scene, a known demo scene uh, track, using only your voice. You can use multi-tracks, but you can only use your voice, no instruments, no banging, no nothing like that, just vocals. Uh, this idea was from Gasman, he had requested it before already for a few other instances, so why not incorporate it into this event? Um, then we have the Love Byte Tiny Intro Invitation, which is a Love Byte is a, a demo scene event that's going to happen in March. I'm going to help uh, them with some hosting and stuff like that. Um, and they're going to be focused on doing tiny sized intros, so anything below 512 bytes. Um, so I thought we could do a competition specially focused on inviting people to attend that event. Because if we get any tiny intro entries, 
of any kind is going to be to invite people to work on that event anyways, so might as well just focus the compo on that. Then we're going to have, since it's St. Valentine's Day, we're going to have the demo compo focused on uh, the theme of love, and I expect a total of zero entries to this compo, so any entry that is above zero is going to be a welcome surprise. And uh, let's see if anyone bothers doing any uh, proper demos for this compo at all. Then we have a wild compo if you want to do something that doesn't fit any of the other stuff and it's demo scene related, we'll still show it on the wild compo entry. So yeah, those are the compo ideas that we have uh, right now. Oh, we also have a patchy compo because when we were when I was organizing Inertia, uh, Logiker was asking me if I would organize a patchy compo if they had enough entries which we didn't for, for Inertia, but if it's previously announced that it's specific for patch key, maybe a few more people will participate. So let's see, I hope I hope you C64 uh, text art people out there will uh, submit your entries and uh, yeah, have fun with the compo. I'll gladly show the releases. Um, to facilitate viewing, we request everything to be sent either pre-recorded video uh, send the binaries, of course, as well, the executable stuff, but send pre-recorded video, send uh, MP3, 256 uh, kbps, if you if you have uh, music on weird platform, and yeah, any video that plays on, any video format that plays on VLC without crashing VLC should be fine. So, yeah, and PNG for graphics entries as well. <coughs> so, yeah, that's what I've been up to, setting up the whole... Uh, um, online page for that homepage, configuring woohoo a little bit. I still have to do some CSS styling on it, it's just so it doesn't it doesn't have just white background. Um, and yeah, uh, still one month to go to the party, so plenty of time still to test everything, make sure everything is uh, fine. Uh, but yeah, that's what I've been up to. Uh, other things that I've been uh, focused on. I've been playing a few more video games. I, I did a few reviews on that. Didn't do a video though, but I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'll do it. Maybe I won't. I don't know. Not sure anymore. Uh, and the reason for that is that I, at some point, I decided that doing video game reviews on the channel wasn't really giving any numbers. People really avoided them like the plague. I guess people don't really care about the random people reviewing random video games, which is fine. I mean, um, I thought there might be some interest, but there wasn't. So, uh, so yeah, sometimes I do some uh, video game related videos, but I try to avoid doing reviews unless either I really like the game or I put like multiple games into the same video. Anyways, that's my thoughts. But I still wrote the review video on uh, the review on Steam. So if you if you follow the game or if you're looking for reviews on the game, you'll probably find my stuff there. Or if you look at my profile on Steam, it probably has the um, the review listed there. What was I saying? Uh, st other stuff that I've been doing. I have some pending stuff from Enough Records that I need to take care of. Uh, new text releases coming up on Monday, which I need to still prepare and upload. And there's some uh, demos that I have to listen and uh, reply. I already gave it one listen, but I want to give it another one before I reply anything. And the thing is that it's two of them and they're long and I haven't found the time to do it properly yet. Um, Plenty of new releases coming up. Uh, did a new radio show a couple days ago, and I will have to do another one in one month. So it will be released, I think, next week. Not sure. I don't have the calendar open right now. But yeah. And uh, about the creative writing stuff, uh, some of the <coughs> some of the. Um, deadlines that I was aiming for, they ended up being, being pushed back. For example, the steampunk uh, anthology thing is now deadline at the end of January. So I still have uh, 20 days to try to write something uh, on the key of steampunk for that, which might be interesting. There's another call for diesel punk stuff, which I guess is kind of like Mad Max kind of thing, where diesel is the most valuable thing uh, on Earth. 
let's see, maybe if I get any good idea for that kind of stuff, I might participate. Otherwise, I'd probably be busy with other things anyways. So, yeah, I think that's long enough for today's vlog. Uh, hope you find uh, OMZG. And you should say it like OMG with a Russian Z. So, OMZ. OMZ. Something like that. I don't know. I have to practice my uh, accent for the live stream. Because I will be trying to do it uh, speaking Moldavian, sort of. So, let's see how that works out. Um, anyways, that's it from this vlog. Thank you for watching. Let me know what you think on the comments below. See you next time. Bye-bye, everyone. Take care.